Well, thank you very much, Teresa, and uh, assalamu alaikum, and uh, a warm welcome to you all here to Victoria University to share in this iftar dinner. I'd particularly like to acknowledge Ahmet Keskin, the Executive Director of the Australian Intercultural Society, and our partner here tonight, the Honourable Marsha Thompson, MP, uh, Helen Kaplos, the chair of the Victorian Multicultural Commission and her fellow multicultural BMC commissioners. Uh, Councillor John Hedditch, mayor of the Brimbank City Council. Councillor Lee Liu, city of Melbourne. Hus Mustafa, the Multicultural Community Banking Australia, Commonwealth Bank. And uh, Victoria University Council, Victoria University Council members, other distinguished guests, friends of Victoria University and colleagues. Before we commence, I do wish to acknowledge the recent tragedy in Baghdad, in which our friends from Sirius College lost a valued member of their community, Zainab al-Habir, and our condolences are with you during this very difficult time. Ramadan is, of course, a special time for the Muslim community. The Iftar event is shared by the Islamic community in the spirit of coming together of generosity, friendship and belonging. The coming together at the end of each day's fast during Ramadan is significant to Muslim families all over the world as they share their homes and their meals with family and friends, new and old. It is significant that uh, Victoria University embraces this event as we too share the vision of inclusivity, respecting the bonds that are forged when respectful relationships are fostered and developed. And I'd like to offer my sincere thanks to the Australian Intercultural Society who've partnered with Victoria University to host this iftar dinner tonight. And uh, the Executive Director, uh, Mr. Ahmed Keskin, and his extended team are welcome friends of the university and I'm pleased that you've been able to collaborate with us again uh, this year. I'd also like to thank all those involved in supporting the event under the leadership of Susan Young, uh, Dean of uh, the, the Centre for Student Success. Uh, thank you, Susan, for your leadership on behalf of Victoria University. Victoria University is proud to provide a shared space for people of many faiths and backgrounds to come together in the spirit of peace and connection. These are the notions that are fundamental to the occasion of Ramadan. The key themes we're acknowledging and celebrating at tonight's event are inclusivity, diversity, belonging, and multiculturalism, a fair go for all. These themes resonate very strongly with, with me as Vice-Chancellor of Victoria University. Uh, Victoria University is the university of opportunity and success. We're an inclusive, open university that provides outstanding educational opportunities for students from very diverse backgrounds. And we are a university with one of the most diverse backgrounds of all student communities in Australia. Our students come from a wide range of cultural, educational and socioeconomic backgrounds, creating a uniquely diverse student community, which is a great environment for them to learn to be successful in a globalised world of the 21st century. I think that cultural diversity is part of our DNA and VU takes great pride in being a university that takes this reality and makes it an advantage. Last year we celebrated a centenary of opportunity, 100 years since our predecessor institution, Footscray Technical School, first welcomed our students. It was also our 25th anniversary as a university. And these milestones signify the, trans signify the transformational impact that Victoria University had and continues to have on a diverse cohort of students every year. We're proud of our deep connection with the community. This space here in Metro West is a great example of that, particularly here in our heartland, the west of Melbourne, where we're embedding ourselves as an integral part of this uh, of this uh, wonderful area and this growing region of the west of Melbourne. We have a responsibility to work with our local community and work towards social cohesion, inclusivity and belonging. At VU we're committed to developing global citizens who make an impact in their chosen careers. We've recently announced a new initiative, the VU Academy, which will provide high achieving and high potential students with the opportunity to develop their leadership, entrepreneurship and citizenship skills in a globalised world and importantly we want our students to be empowered and able to achieve success for themselves and for others. 
We also develop a professional, um, we're developing a professional development program for staff to understand how they might work with cultural diversity in a constructive way. And Teresa DeFazio, our MC for tonight, is playing a leadership role in that, in uh, a program that's helping academics to understand how they might work with cultural diversity in a constructive way. And it specifically counters the more deficit views that have no place in our teaching practice. It challenges the messages that difference is difficult, rather, than, ra rather it supports the development of intercultural capabilities that are pertinent to both active scholarship and citizenship. So uh, this is just a, a very small snapshot of how Victoria University is playing its role in ensuring we provide an inclusive and open university that uplifts our heartland, the west of Melbourne and beyond. Uh, later tonight, we're in, we'll be engaging in a panel discussion focusing on the themes of inclusivity, diversity, belonging and multiculturalism, a fair go for all. And very pleased that Helen Kapalos, the chair of the Victorian Multicultural Commission, is agreed to chair uh, the panel this evening. And our panellists include, include um, Kashif Bonds. Kashif, where's Kashif? Over there. And uh, from the mighty Western Bulldogs. And uh, two of our students, PhD candidate and uh, and Victoria University Council member Gofran El Naziri, welcome Gofran, and Vice President of the of the uh, VU Islamic Student Association, Ghazala Naz. So, I'm greatly looking forward to hearing the thoughts and insights of these accomplished people. And I hope you all enjoy this evening's event. And please visit here, uh, uh, visit us here at Victoria University at any time. Uh, thank you, and Ramadan Mubarak. <laughs>